Oh, Travis, your math teacher, Miss Pritchett, got new boobs. We did, we did all bait and switch. Yeah, we told, we, we kind of teased everyone with what the show might have been, and then about seven or eight episodes in, we totally changed it around because we didn't want to write that anymore. <laughs> <laughs> and it's been more fun. Well, you know, we, we could, we, there was two paths we could have gone. We could have kept the show basically going as a concept show where it's, it's, it's simply about a woman who's out there trying to date younger men and live life. And that's totally valid and you can totally do that show. But we had such a good cast, we thought it was almost a disservice to all of them and to Courtney to just make it that. Um, so instead of having her as the center of this universe where, all, where she's with young men and then other things are happening on the sidelines, there was such a great dynamic between between her and Ian, between her and Allie, between her and Jules, between Andy and Ellie. We thought it would be a lot richer and a lot more fun to explore that, and I think the show's gotten a lot better because of that. I wouldn't say that she doesn't like him still, but there's definitely, uh, yeah, it's definitely softened a little bit. Um, but we have, they have to not like each other still, otherwise, like, have, I don't know what I'm going to write jokes for. Like, I can't write, everyone can't be friends, and there's no, there's no drama there. Maybe we'll, we'll like bust them apart or something, or maybe Travis will do something horrible, and Bobby and Travis will hate each other. Someone has to hate each other at the core of this show. I'm not sure who it is yet. Maybe that's like season two. Maybe Ellie and Ellie and uh, Ellie and Jules. Maybe they fall apart, or maybe Jules and Lori fall apart. That's possible.